Hi, welcome to day four. Today we're going to talk about acceptance. Why? Well, just think about what happens when you don't like what somebody's suggesting to you, you don't like what somebody's asking you, you don't like what somebody's saying to you, you don't like the weather, you don't like the newspapers, you don't like the clothes you've got, you don't like the house you live in, you don't like the job you have, and it goes on. What does it feel like when you don't like something? Does it feel easy? Does it flow? Does it feel comfortable? No, it doesn't. Because there's resistance there. And when there's resistance, it makes you feel uncomfortable. And it needs to change. So, look at the same scenario and bring in acceptance. When you accept that the weather is raining, when you accept that there's things in the newspaper you don't want to read about, you have a choice. It's raining, you wear an umbrella. You leave earlier, you drive in the car, you get a taxi, you use the underground. You don't like what's in the newspaper, don't read it, don't buy it. You see, in every given situation, you have a choice. And oftentimes you forget that you have a choice. And therefore, if you cannot accept whatever it is that's presented to you, whether it be a situation, whether it be a person, you have a choice. You can change it. You can choose not to speak with this person. You can choose not to hang around with this person. You can choose to look for another job, move departments, work for yourself. And okay, these decisions are big decisions and they might take time to put into practice. But nevertheless, once you've made a decision, once you have decided, once you have taken control and said, no more, I don't want this anymore, I've had enough, then you can make a decision. But if you're umming and ahhing and wanting it to change and you're not prepared to do anything about it, why should the situation change? It's continuing perfectly happy without you. It is you who either has to make a choice, choose to accept or change. So if you don't like a situation, you either accept it because that's changing your perspective. And when you change your perspective, you see things in a different way. And what you look at starts to change. So when you change your perception, you are choosing to accept it and see it in a different light. The alternative to that is, I can't accept it. So it's something that is absolutely non-negotiable for you. Um, you're not prepared to tolerate it. You're not prepared to put up with it. You're not prepared to be in this situation or be around this person anymore. So what do you do? You take steps to change it so rather than changing your perception of the same thing, you're choosing yourself to change. So you're walking away in a polite manner. You're choosing to spend your time with other people rather than this person. You're giving them a wide berth. You're asking if you can move departments if it's a work situation. You're choosing a different project if it's a project that you're working on with this person. And so you're taking control of the situation by changing yourself. So, in any given situation, you have a choice. You either accept it exactly the way it is and see it in a different light and think, well, okay, that's fine. I'll, um, I accept this. Because actually, when you are choosing to accept a situation, you are taking charge of that situation because you are changing your perspective about it. The only thing that's changing is you. In your perspective, you're taking responsibility, you're taking charge, and you're saying, I choose to see this in a different way. So that's giving you the power. Does that make sense? 
Alternatively, you cannot possibly tolerate this situation or person anymore and therefore it is you who has to remove yourself from the situation, from the person. And again, it is you who's taking charge of that situation. It is you who is taking responsibility and making the decision to move out of that space, to move away from that person. So whichever decision you make, when you are accepting that either you have to accept a situation by changing your perspective, or you have to accept that it's not tolerable and move out of the way. Either way, and this is what I'm really trying to get across to you, either way, you are taking responsibility, you are taking back the power, and you are taking charge of the situation, because it's you who's making the decision. And therefore, acceptance is a choice that you make. You either accept something you cannot change, or you change something you cannot accept. And it really is as simple as that. And most of the time we make things far too complicated and there's no need to. So keep it simple. Kiss. Keep it simple, sweetie. Accept the people and situations and circumstances that you are unable to change or change the things, the people, the situations, the circumstances that you are not able to accept by changing yourself, by removing yourself. I hope that's helped you today because that's day four and uh, it's a bit late in the day because I've been uh, busy this evening. So I will see you tomorrow for another challenge. Have a great evening. Bye for now.